What's going on guys? It's Quizzy Dog here, and in today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at the Motion Gray Sit Stand Desk. All right, so the first thing to go over is what exactly is a sit-stand desk? And honestly, I think it's fairly explanatory. It's a motorized desk, something that has a top and legs, and it's something that you can both sit at as well as stand at. And the benefits are, of course, it's very versatile. It gives you the option to sit down as you typically would in the past, but allowing you as well to elevate the desktop and use it in a standing fashion. Now, for me personally, I don't use this for computing or everyday work. I actually use this as kind of a YouTube showcase desk. And this is honestly one of my favorite heights right here. It's a little bit above my waist, but it gives me the opportunity to show you guys products, have a very large tabletop, and give me the freedom of movement a little bit more. I can fidget, I could rock, I can stretch my legs. And for those that may have health concerns, there's benefits as well because prolonged sitting can have adverse side effects. So having the opportunity to bring this up to a more comfortable level and stand for a period of time is actually very good for your back. It's very good for your posture. And overall, it's gonna be very good for your mood as well. So this motion grade desk is completely motorized. Now, there are some sit stand options available on the market that are not motorized and simply they operate by usually like a crank and a gear mechanism. You crank clockwise or counterclockwise and that's either going to raise or lower the desktop. But in this case, being completely automatic, you do have a nice little controller right here. Now, operation is super easy. All you're going to do is press a button to engage the LCD. We're gonna see that right here. And simply hold up. You're gonna notice that it's gonna start going up. You can let go, you can hold down, and it's going to, of course, go down. You also have one through four right here as well. And if we press one, what this is going to do is actually elevate this desk to my preset, which in this case would be 100 on the controller here. We can also come in and let's say we want to bring this down to, let's just go to 90 to save some time. You can actually hit M, which is mode. You can hit the number two. And what this is going to allow you to do is this is going to set this 90 as a preset. So if I wanted to press the number one, this will go up automatically to the 100 preset. If I wanna hit two, this is simply going to come down to the number two preset. And you can set these to your liking. Again, there are four, and it makes it very easy to actually go ahead and transition between your preferred seating and your preferred standing orientation. Now, one of the things that makes this desk really special would be the motors that they chose to use. Now, unlike other desks on the market that may only have one motor or may have a dual motor system, the Motion Gray actually utilizes German-made Bosch motors. They're located within each of the legs on either far side of the tabletop. And this not only allows very smooth transitions in between your height, but it also can carry up to 225 pounds. So if you have a big desktop, or if you're like me and just want to lay on the desk to see if it can lift you up, don't worry. As long as you're under 225 pounds or your setup itself is under 225 pounds, this thing is not going to break a sweat. So on the underside of the desk, we can actually see exactly how clean it is. Now, you do have your frame system here, very, very strong, very durable, but we also see here we have the AC brick. Now, 
This guy here is very easily concealed just right within the frame itself, and it also comes with cable tidies to make sure that you can hide away all of your cables. The power cable that's gonna run into, let's say a power brick or into your wall is also very thick. It's very long, so you're not gonna have any issues. And those German made Bosch motors are also housed right within the lag itself. So you're not gonna see them. They're not gonna be protruding out in any way. And overall, you're just left with a really clean and really aesthetic look. Now, speaking about clean looks, we also have your lag system right here. And another place that Motion Gray shines is the fact that their lags are actually three-piece supports. Now, what that means is not only are you going to get more height, but you're also going to get more stability. Because each one of these has the ability to be a little bit shorter, they all extend within themselves. Now, other desks that I've seen on the market only offer two frames or two pieces on the inside and what tends to happen is when you extend those too far away from one another you actually get some wobbles and you get some shakes and that's going to transition into an unstable work area at maximum height if you're working with coffee cups or even just a hard time typing if by chance you're using it as a desk for a computer so having these guys here the three supports very very welcomed addition now to continue along the train of thought when it comes to aesthetics, we can see here that you also have a cable grommet or pass through. Now this I could almost live without and to be completely honest and transparent, I wish they had included this and maybe given you the option to drill your own hole in its own placement, or maybe allowed you to pick a tabletop that didn't have this included. For me and my use, where this is more of a showcase table, I find that aesthetically that tends to get in the way, but for others that are using this as just a regular desk, this is a welcomed addition because it's going to allow you to route all of your cables safely in here and then tuck them underneath the desk instead of having them roll over the side. Now, another thing as well, kind of on the train of thought when it comes to the top of the desk, this desktop does come included with the set of legs. That is something that I find is often missed when you're looking at sit-stand desks online. It looks like it's a good price. It looks like it comes with everything, but read the fine print because a lot of the times the desktop itself is not included. In this case, Motion Gray does include this. They actually have two different colors of tops and two different colors of legs as well. They also have two sizes of tops, but other than the cable grommet that we talked about before being kind of pre-drilled and included, the bottom of the desk is not pre-drilled. So be prepared to position this yourself. It's not hard. I did mine with a measuring tape and just a hand-based screwdriver. You don't need a drill, or at least you shouldn't need a drill. And although I would have liked the desktop to be pre-drilled just to make sure that the placement was kind of where they wanted it to be. At the same time, I like the freedom of it not being pre-drilled because it would allow me to let's say widen the base or shorten the base based on my individual needs. I don't know if that's what they were going for, but let's say that it was because in this case, I truly think it was a smart move. Now, I think at this point, you've seen me standing more than enough. So let's sit down and let's talk one-on-one -on -one and discuss kind of what I like about this desk. We've went over, of course, some of the features, what makes it special and what I think sets it apart from other sit-stand desks on the market. But one of the best features that I really, really enjoy when it comes to this motion grade desk would be the ability to go all the way down to 60 centimeters in height. Now, a lot of people will not use that height on a regular basis for productivity that's gonna be far too low. Honestly, you could put a cushion on the floor and sit and use it at that height, almost like a, a coffee table. But for me, when I'm doing a lot of product shots for this YouTube channel, I have the availability of actually utilizing that lowest height to do very quick and effective top-down shots. And that was something that was very difficult for me previously with just a regular desk. I used to have a desk from Ikea, the Linman with the Adel's legs, and I would have to extend my tripod so far up that the camera would then become unstable and it was just 
too hard to function. So this going all the way down to 60 centimeters is a big plus and something I've seen a lot of demand for oddly enough online. So this will certainly do it. The maximum height, I don't know what it is in centimeters. I'll kind of put it on the screen somewhere now but I believe it's just over four feet. And we've seen that in some of the product shots that I've done in this video so far. So you would have to be well beyond six feet for the need to have anything that tall. But truthfully, the other benefit of going much higher than you need is it makes it very easy for cable management underneath. You're not crouched down and breaking your neck trying to look up and see what's going on. Just put it at max height, cable manage nice and comfortably, and then bring it back down to your working area. Everything about this, 99% of this product, I absolutely love. My only gripes, if I were to be hypercritical, again, would be this grommet right here. I wish that they had excluded it and just given me the opportunity to go buy one of these for like $10 or maybe included it on the side with the ability to pre-drill the hole wherever you want it to be. Uh, the tabletop itself, I did get the dark color and I love it. It's very durable. I've had this desk for more than I, I want to admit. You guys have probably seen this in the studio for maybe the last like two months. But I do find that because it is a high gloss top, it tends to collect a lot of fingerprints. So I find it kind of difficult to keep clean. Maybe the white might be a little bit better, but for me, most of my office is all dark contrasted accents to white walls. So I wanted to go with the dark top with the white legs. You can go white legs, white top, dark legs, uh, dark top, or a mix match, which is what I did with the white legs and the dark top. Other than that, I think that about wraps everything up. If Yeah, I don't think there's anything else. Um, so again, I, I'm not here to market this sit stand desk lifestyle. They're going to tell you that you're going to burn a thousand extra calories. There's all of this stuff. There's all these health benefits. And although I do believe in most of them, that's not why I ended up getting this. For me, I only got this to do kind of cool things like this. If I want to bring this down and I want to have the availability to kind of hunch over and get work done, or if I want to stand up and cut my head at a frame and work while I'm standing up. All of that is possible. Just waiting for this. All of that is possible with this desk. And that's the one thing that makes my life so much easier. In fact, since getting this desk, my wife was so jealous that I got her sit-stand desk as well. And we're gonna go over that in another video in the future to learn about some of the differences in that one. But overall, very satisfied. As a content creator, this is worth its weight in gold. It truly, truly is. As somebody who would use it for work, I'm gonna bring this back down because this is kind of uncomfy. Just give me a second. It's fast, at least. And I don't know if you guys can hear that, but it's fairly quiet as well. But if you're like me, you're creating content, or if you are working in a work from home environment, the climate that we're in uh, health-wise is very unique and something that we've really never faced. And, and a lot of people have been making do for about the last year, but I don't think things are changing. So if you do want a more comfortable ergonomic experience, I would consider an option like this. If not the motion gray desk that I have right here, and of course links will be in the description below. This is not paid for, there's no affiliate codes, anything like that. Um, but if you wanna know pricing and availability, I love this desk. I've used now three different ones and this by far is still my favorite for a number of reasons. It's quiet, it's height, how low it goes, its size, 
Everything about it just made sense for me. And that's why I wanted to put together this video to kind of showcase all of that to you. So if you did find this video at all helpful, insightful, anything like that, go ahead and leave a like and leave a comment as well and tell me what you took from this content. But until my next video, my name is Crazy Dog. You guys have been awesome and we'll catch you all in my next one. Take care.